Today, we're going to talk about the Crypto.com Ruby card. How much does it cost? It's also known as the Crypto.com Ruby Steel card. But we're going to talk about how much does it cost? Uh, what is it? How much does it cost to get it? And is it worth it? By the way, quick heads up. This content was released first on the library platform. You can come check me out on library. There's a link in the description. It's basically a decentralized version of YouTube. A lot of content up there. YouTube, every YouTube creator should be up there. Uh, it's a, a great platform. You can actually earn free LBC tokens just for watching content. You'll get 20 free tokens just for clicking on my invite link down below. Those tokens are currently valued at about four cents each, I believe, at the time of this video. Come join me on library. Okay, let's talk about the MC, the crypto.com card. So the crypto.com card, I say MCO because that's their, one of their native tokens, but the crypto.com card is the best debit card on the planet. And I got to say this right now. Crypto.com is probably the best crypto financial product website company that exists on the planet. They're not just a debit card, although that's one of their best features. It's the easiest way to cash out any cryptocurrency that you have. You can use any ATM that takes Visa, any any place that will take, you know, Visa card will take your Crypto.com card. And that's awesome because you can load up crypto inside your Crypto.com account on the card, spend it just as good as basically dollars it's awesome and so it's a combination of that it's primarily an app like there's no way to log in on the website i'll put a link down in the description you can get uh, download the app if you use my affiliate link down there and or you might have to type manually type in the referral code on your phone if you do that you will get 50 dollars back for setting up your crypto.com ruby card and i'll break all that down in this video so there's a lot that goes on here. They have a earn platform where you can earn interest, uh, and I'll cover this more in the future. But basically, it's by far on on stable coins you can make 12% per annum right now. I mean, it's by far the best savings account. It's it's probably the best bank account in the world, including in the crypto space uh, and in the fiat U.S. dollar space. I mean, it is unreal. Where else is uh, who else is paying you 12% a year to hold basically U.S. dollar value? I mean, that's just nuts. And they, they pay you uh, on cryptocurrency. I'm sorry. They pay you on so many other cryptocurrencies. I think you make 6% a year on Bitcoin or 4% a year, something like that, just for holding Bitcoin. Uh, it, it's 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 awesome. It's absolutely awesome. All right. So let's get back to the card. That's what we're talking about. Oh, that was the exchange. My bad. Let's come back to the. Let's come back to the card. Oh, by the way, right now you can buy using your credit card or debit card on the app 100% free. No fees. I think Coinbase is like 2% if you use your credit card, debit card. Theirs are free. All right. So if you come to the cards, let's talk about the, the Ruby cards are first like premium card. So in order to get the card, what does it take? Well, you have to, you have to take 50 MCO tokens and you have to stake them on the platform. Now, a couple of things. That's important to understand. You get the, the MCO tokens you stake on the platform. You stake them for four months. At the end of the four months, they give you the card. Now, you don't actually pay for the card itself is except in the tokens. So you, right now, to get 50 MCO tokens, you'd have to go take a look. 50 MCO tokens cost $268 right now. So you need $268 roughly to get those 50 MCO tokens. By the way, if you want to buy MCO tokens, if you want or any token for that matter, if you if you're looking for anything to buy the and you don't know where they sell or what exchange, easiest thing in the world is to come to Simple Swap. I'll put a link in the description. Um, I've been using Simple Swap for lab, for lab, LBCs and all sorts of other altcoins. They're freaking awesome, unbelievable, super simple, super fast, no KYC, no AML, super easy. All right, let's get back to MCO and the crypto.com Ruby card. So you stake those 50 tokens, $268 worth of tokens on their platform, but you're gonna make 4% back per annual on that. So you're gonna get basically about 1% of that back just in, you know, which is what, like $2.50 roughly, depending on the value of the MCO token, because it goes up and down. Plus you're getting 2% rewards on all of your spending. So, if you really milk that and you spend a thousand dollars a month and then and, and just for the cash back, right? Spend a thousand dollars a month, I mean that's gonna be twenty dollars. I mean you can you can milk that just in cash back. Plus 
they're going to cover your Spotify. You get Spotify $10 a month, $9.99. You get it you get it reimbursed every single month in the MCO tokens. Just from Spotify alone, when you consider the fact that you need about $268 right now to get the card, 2% cash back. Let's just say you spend $100. You know, that's going to be what? Two, four, six, eight dollars. We'll just call it eight dollars. That's going to be eight dollars. Plus, you're going to get your Spotify, ten dollars a month. So that's going to be another forty dollars because you need to stake the tokens for at least four months anyway. So that's going to be another forty dollars. There we go. Plus, you're going to get fifty dollars back. If you in all, you have to use a referral link or an affiliate link. So if you click on the link in the description, you use that referral code and you get your 50 MCO, you're going to get $50 worth of MCO for free right away. So that's going to be $90. So here's the thing. Let's just say you spend $100 and you may spend more. Let's just say you spend $100 with a crypto. You're going to get 2% cash back. In four months, that's going to be $8 back. You're going to get your Spotify for those four months period. That's going to be $40. You're going to get $50 cash back. So by my math, 40, 50, and eight, that's $98, basically a hundred bucks. So by then the card ends up costing $168 because of the tokens. Now here's the reality. You, you, you technically just made $98 in that same time period because you don't again you don't actually here's what people need to understand you don't lose the the tokens the token price can go up or down it can go down and it can go up lately it's been moving up that's good um, but it can go up it can go down it's down for the year you can see that um, which is a good time to get the freaking tokens by the way since it's down because it's up for the month um, so it's a good time to probably get the tokens B but it's relatively a stable price all the way around in the world of crypto anyway, in the world of crypto. So the, the, if the price goes up, you're going to make money just owning the token uh, from price appreciation as well. And I personally plan to just keep mine stake. This is a project that I want to be involved in, not financial advice for you, but this is a project that I want to be a part of for a really long time. Specifically, I started reading some stuff and learning some stuff yesterday about kind of their future development and what they're looking for. And I will tell you, some people don't like the fact that, you know, you got to do verification, KYC, AML. And by the way, their verification process is by far one of the simplest ways to get verified that I have seen anywhere in the crypto space. It was so easy to get verified. But you do have to get verification. You know, you have to get verified, all that sort of stuff. And people don't like that. And they, they complain about it. But if you look at their roadmap and you look at where the company's heading and what they're doing, they just got released a crypto.com wallet app to go along with the crypto.com app. And the wallet app, you can hold your own private keys and you can hold your currency in your own private, your crypto in your own private keys if you want. Plus, you look at the fact that they have like, you know, $360 million worth of insurance recently. They updated another $100 million to cover any assets. That's their insurance to help cover assets. I mean, th they're moving in the right direction to be able to create mass adoption. And if people can't spend their crypto, for a lot of people, you know, I got a buddy of mine, he's like, if you can't buy me a cup of coffee with it, let's not talk about it. And recently he said that, I said, I can buy you a cup of coffee with it. I can buy you a cigar, I can buy you whatever you want. And he's like, what are you talking about? And I said, man, I got a Visa card. I can spend my cryptocurrency just like cash. And he's like, really? He said, we gotta talk about that. See, now all of a sudden that, that, that creates interest for people. And I think even people who are in this space want to be able to use their cryptocurrency. Now, let's talk about the elephant in the room. It's regulations and regulators. That's why they have KYC AML. But if you look at crypto.com, their roadmap, where they're headed, what they want to do, you look at their news, you look at the projects they're working on, their whole goal is to become more decentralized and more anonymous over time. I mean, that's where they're moving. And I that's why I want to hold this token, because I believe if there ever becomes a time where the market demands anonymity in crypto and it's possible to move in that direction at all, I believe that Crypto.com is going to be prepared to do that. All you got to do is look at the roadmap of their R the CRO token and their MCO tokens. All right. So that's so how much does a Crypto.com? Let's wrap it up with this. How much does a Crypto.com Ruby card cost? Um 
Well, you got to put out 250, to you got to stake 50 tokens, the price of those 50 tokens. But in all reality, it doesn't cost anything. You get your tokens back and you actually make money by getting the freaking card. You're going to make $50 right away just for using the link in the description. And then you're going to get $10 a month in MCO tokens uh, to cover your Spotify. Then you're going to get 2% back on all of your spending. I mean, then you step up over here. See, that's a whole nother ball game. By the way, I'm a part of the black card challenge. The black card challenge is working towards the black card, the black MCO card. That's my goal. This thing has everything. It's unreal what all you get with the MCO, uh, the, the MCO Ruby card. I really want this one. This is my next uh, main target. I really want this one. And the single biggest perk for me is going to be access to airport lounges when I travel. Single biggest perk for me. And plus, 3% cash back. Hello. Crypto.com Ruby card. I think everyone in crypto should own it. No question about it. Of course, they should uh, make sure they get their $50 back for owning it. And also, it's one of the best ways to earn passive income in cryptocurrency just by using the Earn platform. We'll be talking about that in the future. Be sure to subscribe if you want to hear more about that in the future. If you like the idea of being able to spend your cryptocurrency when you choose, when you want, and you like it with a company that's there that is you know crypto friendly but able to navigate through the regulatory spaces in a way that nobody else has done in the crypto space, smash that freaking like button. Can you do that? Smash that like button. By the way, if you're trying to buy MCO tokens, you're looking for where you can buy it outside the crypto.com platform, Simple Swap is going to be the easiest place to buy it. I have a link in the description. I've been using Simple Swap to uh, for buying and selling library to uh, library LBCs, and I absolutely love, 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 love Simple Swap. Give a big shout out to these guys. And if you like earning passive cryptocurrency, then I think I haven't covered it in a lot of detail yet. But Crypto.com is one very good way to earn passive cryptocurrency. It looks very stable. looks very safe. And you can make 12% a year, 1% basically, on U.S. dollar value in stable coins. That is insane. We'll be talking about that more. And if you want to find out other ways to earn passive cryptocurrency, go down in the description. Subscribe to my Crypto Passive Profits newsletter. Join the newsletter. Join us as we talk about all things passive crypto, particularly passive Bitcoin. Thank you so much for watching. Remember, crypto equals freedom. This is Crypto Wealth. I'm out.